Hi guys, next game up, it's Crawley Town, so, yeah. <laughs> Hopefully this will go nice and smoothly, the team is now much better rested, so for the first time in a long time we're going to put a full strength out. In fact, that is a lie, we are going to rest some players, because I have Everton coming up in the cup. So all of my best players are going to be rested, and we are putting out a second strength team, which is highly risky, but the world loves the chancer. There we give him a game, keep him happy. There we go. So Berry gets a game and Matic gets a game. Everyone else is second straight. Let's see how much I have regret this. Hello everyone, the heavens opened earlier and the rain shows no inclination to stop. We're looking forward to the game anyway. My name is Derek Ray and joining me for commentary is Stuart Robson. I'm very much ready to bring you the cut and throw. Can he put it away? Oh, <laughs> Of course, if things are going badly, I can bring on all those players. For what? Free kick. Well, as you can see, when it comes to the hosts, they certainly know a thing or two about scoring goals. In fact, Stuart, they have the most potent attack in the league. Well, they're, in the wild, I should imagine. they're always looking to pass it forward. The wide players get good crosses into the box, and the forwards have taken their chances. These fans will be hoping for more of the same today. Well, there to intercept. Well, that's a really good authoritative tackle. Throwing so you're going to spend the whole game on the floor. Unable to take advantage of that developing situation. Well, the situation has changed in one of the other games. Here's Alex Scott with the news. Yeah, it's a goal for Mansfield Town. They've scored the opener here with nine minutes. Oh no, what a chance this is! Just <laughs> tackling, excellent defending there. Well, we never like cutting off Alex, but sometimes we have to do it for understandable reasons when things are happening. Oh, that's going to be a red. That's disgusting. You wouldn't be surprised to see the card handed out. We're going to see the first yellow card of the game. The referee not standing on ceremony. Well, he's under pressure now. It's a long time to be on a booking. Long way out this. And disappointingly, straight into the wall. Sound piece of goalkeeping. Struggling to keep the ball. Oh, goalkeeper mistake. Will there be a price to pay? Ben Ferguson. Well, support available. And credit oh. is due for that good piece of defending. Dom Telford. And the counter attack is on. Options available. Well, that is how to play advantage. They need to get bodies back. This looks more than decent. He'll be breathing a sigh of relief. Ball one. Please remove the gun as soon as possible. Thank you. Stop them in their tracks. I would love to get some decent youth players in. And fired from the flank into yeah, the area. Making so happy. <laughs> Can't do Lee. Could be troublesome. 
Must take the lead here. Well, good defending. It's offside anyway. For some reason he's stood behind the goalkeeper. And a creative look about this. Could take the lead. And a goal. Oh, sorry. This is a very tidy finish, as you can see. He's under so much pressure, but his strength just allows him to hit through the ball cleanly. It's an excellent goal. Now back underway, and 1-0 it is. Let's see what happens next. Jack Powell. Dom Telford. And that is going to be a free kick. Just a succession of drag lines where that player's fallen over. But didn't, Stuart. Yeah, and I like that from the referee. It's not a yellow card for me. Into the box it goes. The referee knew that was foul play, but advantage it is. Oh, a lovely ball. Yeah, that is anger. The great ball by Massa there. Well, here it is again, and it's a superbly weighted through ball to break that defensive line. But there's still plenty to do from here. He hits it so well, though. Lots of pace, lots of power, and the keeper just can't react in time. It's a great strike. And the ball is moving again. 2 0 is how it stands. Oh, to keep it <laughs> we kept that on. Now, I believe changing circumstances in one of the other games. Alex Scott will tell us more. It's a oh. goal for Salford City. They've scored the open up with 33 minutes played. Alex keeping us right up to date. Well, no surprise there. The hosts have enjoyed most of the possession and they've made good use of it. They really have played some good attacking football and they look like scoring Oh, more. wait a minute. They could well be in. Oh, a superb save. It's unusual for Dooley. He normally puts them away. A oh, very effective play and they might be onto something. He might be able to make it through. <laughs> and an best he has a lot of left foot there. Given us away. Dreadful pass. And now passing it through. And brave goalkeeping to deal with the danger. Well, he really? had to get that right, didn't he? Shoot before Let's the goalkeeper go. gets too close. Thanks for that. Another great bit of Getting advice. Right on top of their opponents and winning it back. I would love to. But when my players have dribbling of about 60 rated, it, it can be difficult sometimes. Poor pass. Well, if you're wondering about added time, two minutes it'll be. Dooley. Promising looking attack. Decided to take <laughs> on the shot from a difficult angle. Well, from that position, it's a very good effort. Just inches away from being a brilliant goal. And there it is. The half time whistle is sounded. No. We were fine to carry on with that. So the two teams have switched around and the second half is underway. Oh, Barry's done them all. Chance to finish. And there it is. Three goals in front now. An immense performance.
Well, here we can see just how good this goal is. It has everything. Skill, pace and power. There was no stopping him there. Is this going to be a thrashing? 3-0 now. You can wait till his ratings in the 90s. There could be trouble here. He's already been cautioned. They will now make use of the substitutes bench. And the goalkeeper's touch, that was crucial. So, a corner here. And a struggle to get it away properly. Chance maybe. <laughs> Just hit the keeper twice. <laughs> Perfectly positioned to take it away. Well, many have wondered if they would get it over the line in terms of the deal. They've succeeded, Stuart. Well, at around £40 million, I think that's good value. Because if he does produce his best form, then they've signed a really good player. One that will certainly improve their team. Whoa, cool. Uh, he continues his run. Good stuff. thinking defensively. Oh, he falls over, doesn't he? Number 10. Matic. He's had the first half on the floor. Position he found himself in, he really should be testing the keeper. Should Superb score. opportunity squandered. Should be scoring. And time for the change now. <clears throat> well, a goal update for us to know about. Let's hear more from Alex Scott. It's a goal for Salford City. They're pulled ahead by two with 56 minutes. Angus. Many thanks, Alex. It is a decent looking attack here. Inside he goes. Oh yes! Outrageous. And now a chance for them to revel in the moment. Well here we can see it again, and he does so well to skip beyond the defender. He just buys him that bit of time to get his shot away. That's a really nice goal. So back underway at 3-1. It's there for him. Look at Barry's throw for you. Well, here we can see it again. Look at the way he glides past the defender to create space for himself. But there's still plenty for him to do. Under all sorts of pressure from the defender, he's just able to keep him at bay and finishes with a plum. It's a great goal. Dom Telford. And running it back. No. Awarded then by the referee. And over again, did he? Attacking possibilities here. He's managed to get in behind. It has to be surely. In it goes. Such a complete performance. Four in front now. Well, here it is again, and the pace in which they break forward is devastating. It's so hard to defend against, and there's certainly no doubt about the finish. He really hits it with power and accuracy. Nothing the keeper can do about that. A glut of goals. 5-1 it is. Good tackle, take it away. He's given it straight to the opposition. And there's been a change to the scoreline in one of the other games. Alex has details. It's a goal for Rochdale. They're ahead by two now with 71 minutes played. What a game of football we have on our hands here today, Derek. Alex with the info as ever. Cheers, Alex. He has teammates around him. He's in with a chance. Well, here's the replay. Watch how he goes past his man with such ease, and it's just a change of pace. And once he gets onto it, he just smashes it past the keeper with great technique. What an emphatic finish that is. Rodrigo. Jack Powell. 
James Tilly. Travis Johnson. 15 minutes left for play. On a pass that lacks quality. Mason. Oh, he's really opened them up here. He's done nothing. That's what he's done. Breaking at pace. Opportunity it is. Hopefully bring me down. <laughs> He's having a field day. Well, here it is again, and it's all about the pace in transition. They're so quick to get out from the back, and when he gets onto it, he decides to go for power. It's a really emphatic finish, which gives the keeper no chance. Well, if there were any lingering doubts about the outcome, surely they now have been removed. Clean challenge. He cannot pass. So almost at full time, and the home side very much in command. Stuart, what have you made of their overall performance? Well, what an excellent performance this has been. They've had complete control for most of the game. Their movement, clever passing and energy have been a joy to watch. It's been a really good win for them. Oh, he looks threatening. Well, that's how to hit them. <laughs> Not quite accurate enough, though. And time for the change now. Poor attempt at a pass, really. Dom Telford. A really sumptuous ball. And there it is! A goal! But will it be purely a consolation at this stage of the proceedings? They haven't been at their best. Giving the ball away. Dom Telford. Useful looking ball. And now in a dangerous position. Boom. <laughs> Well, I have to say, this is a really good goal. Just look how well balanced he is. He knows he's going to be under pressure. Yeah. And he shows great composure to him. Hi, Lydia. Welcome back from there, sorry. Okay. Bye, Blanca. Yes. That's some lovely antibiotics you have there, Lydia. She's not very well, but so. Well, as they restart the game, it's fair to say the golf and qu and there it is, the final whistle. The home fans are going to be happy with this result. Well, Derek, what a good performance! They did most things right, and their attacking play was invented and had a real. Oh no! It might be taking your medicine away. Oh, yeah. Sorry about that. <laughs> no, no further questions. Uh, I've got to go do the screaming child. Next up, we have Everton. Uh, thanks for watching, guys.